Hello, I'm Chuck Piscatello, and one burning question I get a lot, especially when I'm holding this little thing up and walking around campus with this is, Chuck, what is that strange little camera? So in this video, I'll demonstrate uh, some videos that we already shot in 360 and maybe some of the capabilities that we have when we shoot in 360. One huge takeaway is soon enough we'll have the virtual reality lab in the library. But until then, we do have the equipment to play with 360 videos. So you can use it on your cell phone. You can use it on a Google Cardboard or on the Oculus. Either way, it works awesome and it gives students that immersive experience that you wouldn't have just in a regular lecture video. So let me demonstrate. So here I'll give a demonstration of three recent videos that we recorded for classes here at AU using the 360 camera. This first one is with Professor Overland over at the seminary for his biblical archaeological class. He's here sitting with Professor Walter about the ancient artifacts that we have over at the seminary. Here you can see even before he hit the play button you can look around. We have this in 180, just so you don't have to see the stuff behind them, but you can look around and even feel like you're a part of a conversation as they discuss these ancient artifacts. Let me go ahead and hit the play button. All right. The earliest lamp is the Persian lamp okay. with the spout that is elongated. Well, I shouldn't say that the, the wick rest is elongated, All right. so that the wick would fit in there. It wouldn't be able to slip out. The shallow background means that we don't have to waste a lot of oil. That lamp is mm -hmm. not going to have to have that much oil. Mm -hmm. But the next stage of this Persian lamp period is to fold the sides together. Right. So we were able to look around this video and be part of their conversation. Uh, students can feel like they're in the room as these two gentlemen can discuss these lamps and share their expertise about the lamps. They can see how big they are as they hold them and talk about them back and forth. Another great example of the use of 360 camera is with Professor Saunders. Uh, she was able to bring the camera on site, observation in sight. So even without hitting play, we're able to look up and look at the foliage, look down, um, see anything that's going on. And also we can listen to nature, observe any wildlife, observe anything that's going on, any kind of movement, any sounds that are going on, and just be able to look around. So once again, students will be able to have this immersive feel. This could be embedded directly into Blackboard, and they too can observe this site. Professor Saunders is planning on doing this on multiple seasons so they can see what it looks like throughout the year. Uh, and then the third example is Professor Strauff uh, for criminal justice. Here she is showing how to measure a body in a crime scene. So we can look around the room at the crime scene, even without hitting play. We can see the weapon and how everything is tagged. We can look at the body, we can look at the floor, and then we can hit play and she'll give a demonstration on how to measure. Trying to pinpoint her back in this position. So since her knees are bent, we would be able to measure from her toe up to her knee. We can do the left side, we can also measure the right side from the right foot up to the right knee, kind of show exactly where the bend would be at. And then we could take two sets of, of measurements. And all those videos were so amazing, just on a flat screen, because you can look around the video, it's just not a flat video. And it's super easy to do. Just plop this down, you can turn it on with your phone and be able to just hit record. But think of how much better it would be if you could just slide your phone in on the Google Cardboard and you can physically just look around like you're in the room. Or even better, on the Oculus, plop it on and be in the room with Professor Strauff as she's measuring the body. Be out in nature with Professor Saunders looking around and listening to the environment or sitting in the room with Professor Overland as they're talking about those ancient artifacts or what ideas do you have in shooting 360 video and watching it on an Oculus or just on your phone.
If you're interested, contact LearnAU, we would love to help.